kids in Central Florida are either out of school for the summer or they're just about to be. So if you are concerned about what they will be up to, personal safety apps can offer an easy high tech way to keep tabs on them from alarms to GPS tracking. The apps market is now flooded with programs designed to save you from an attacker or just keep families in touch. News 6 investigator Lewis Bolden shows us how a few of them work. Left right combination. Go. Jared Arthur knows a thing or two about how to stay safe. Drive me back. Go, 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 go. For more than a decade, she specialized in teaching self-defense, which now includes how to use your phone to help you stay safe. Lately, I've been getting a lot of questions about safety apps. Safety apps like Be Safe, Circle of Six, Red Panic Button, and Guardly are among a growing number of programs designed to instantly alert authorities or friends if you believe you're in danger. These particular apps all have similar features. They'll send your location to those people you designate as an emergency contact. With the free Be Safe app, for example, if you press the SOS alarm. A siren will sound, flashlight will turn on, and your guardians will receive an SMS message. In that message, the contacts you've set as guardians will get a map of your location, video of what's happening around you, and your phone will even call your primary guardian, which can be 911 dispatchers. I'm going to put my finger right on the button, okay. and now I'm walking to my car. Jarrett likes apps like SafeTrack that notify police of your location when you hit a button. I get hit, I get tackled, I have to fight back and I ditch my phone. Then that phone call is being made and the signal is being made automatically to the authorities. I've called 911. Cindy Yokoyama downloaded safety apps on her phone for extra protection. If I was alone and not without, with, with my kids, I think I'd feel also comfortable having a safety app in one hand and one hand and using the other hand for safety. If you've got kids, there's also safety apps out there that are geared towards allowing you to keep an eye on your family. For example, with the free app Life360. You'll see your whole family on a private map and be able to stay in touch with the one tap check in button. If there's a problem, you just press the alert button and everyone gets a message letting them know you need help. You can also track to see that your kids made it home when they were supposed to. In the event of an emergency, as we head into hurricane season, you'd also be able to let family members know you were safe, even if you couldn't get a call to go through. There are plenty more apps that offer safety features to choose from. Some are free and others have either a one-time fee or a subscription fee, whichever you decide works best for you. But keep in mind, experts say the best way to stay safe is to be alert and aware of your surroundings at all times. So consider the apps, but don't let your smartphone distract you into a dangerous situation. I'm Lewis Bolden, News 6. Lewis, thank you. And we've put together a list of useful apps, where to find them and the cost. Just head to facebook.com slash news6 right now to find the link at the top of the page.